Okay, let's do a factory reset for this LG Phoenix 5 from AT&T. Uh, this is a reset from settings of the phone. In case that you forgot your password, pattern, or PIN, and you're not able to go to settings, I'm going to leave, leave a link from another video on how to reset your phone using the external keys. Uh, so just uh, find that link on the description of this video or in comment section, okay? Right, so let's go and open settings and let's go at the bottom screen at the bottom. Let's go and open system and then restart and reset and then factory data reset. Okay, open that and everything is going to be deleted on your account. Um, I mean, the, your phone's internal memory like pictures, videos, contacts, download applications, and etc. etc. Um, it is very important that you know your Google information like password and email address because after the factory reset uh, you need to confirm or verify Google in order to proceed and get to the home screen. If you are not able to confirm Google your phone will be blocked permanently so just uh, make sure that you have that information. So let's go back really quick. and. Um, so this is what you need to know. On the backup section, this is the email address, Google Backup. That's the email address that you need to know the password. Um, so make sure that you have, you have that information. Okay, so let's go back to Reset, Factory Data Reset. And then at the bottom, let's go on Reset Phone. If you have a password, panel or PIN, just enter that information there. Once you have entered that information, just hit the OK button. And uh, at the bottom, let's go and delete all, OK? We already went through that everything is going to be deleted on your internal memory. And uh, with the same Google account, you will be able to retrieve the information. If you are ready, just hit delete all. And then reset. So here it's going to take a few minutes for the phone to uh, properly reboot and you're going to take us to the initial setup screen where you will be able to reset or follow the steps to program your phone and get to the home screen. Okay. So just in case that your phone gets stuck on the AT&T logo for more than 8 minutes, that means that something is wrong with the phone. Usually it takes uh, 2 to 3 minutes, okay? So if it takes longer, just uh, long press the power key and um, power off the phone. And since you won't be able to access to the phone internal um, settings to reset it again, just use the link of the video that I'm going to leave in the description because in, at that point you need to reset your phone with the external keys, okay? So just so you know, uh, you don't have to worry about in case that your phone gets stuck on the logo or uh, anything. Alright, so we are on the initial setup screen. Uh, just uh, let's go and choose a language, language and these are the languages that you can use on this LG Phoenix phone. Okay, and just select your uh, favorite language and then hit the arrow and here you can uh, choose the skin type uh, like this is the difference that the first one is basically it's a full screen so I prefer that one uh, move network you can set up a uh, Wi-Fi in order to continue or you can insert your active SIM card from AT&T so you can get the a network to confirm or verify Google. If you are just uh, resetting your phone and you don't want to use it under AT&T network, just remove the SIM card to continue. Okay, so you're going to skip this step anyways. Okay, set up your uh, time zone, any time zone that you want, and uh, the date. So to move the month, just use a uh, arrow, hit OK to save, time, minutes, 
AM or PM, hit OK to save and hit next continue. Okay, I recommend you to leave uh, every Google services so you will be able to take advantage of Google location, Google search engine, uh, curate and updates for your Android to stay up to date. Okay, you can go ahead and set up your pattern, password or pin now or you can just uh, skip this step and you can set it up once you get to the home screen. If you have another at and phone and you want to transfer all the information to the new one, just um, turn that feature on or just leap off. Okay, skip per permission. You can set the location. I recommend you to leave that one on. Hit accept, agree to terms and conditions and then done okay so this is how to factor reset this LG Phoenix 5 let me know if you have any questions and please subscribe to the channel and um, yeah just search my other tutorials related to this at and just in case that you need help with any other like talkback issue or hard reset or keyboard or any other um, thing okay let me know thanks so much and subscribe